Snow White, because I've always identified with her. Hello. Um, but I also love Aurora. I love Sleeping Beauty. That's one of my favorites. Yes. Uh, do you typically watch the actual sneak knees before you read It depends on whether I have the time. For a show like Tanya that's very... Uh, deep and developed, I, tep I try to watch the Japanese before I go in. On some of them, I don't want to be spoiled. I want to know what's happening as I, as I go in. Yes? Uh, oh, gosh, there's so many. Um, for right now, I'm just going to be safe and say Totoro. Yes? Seconds. You guys are taking it way easier on that than you You need to be asking her questions that she can answer in one or two words and make it as weird as humanly possible. I find a Subaki butt. There we go, we're getting somewhere. Make it weird. If you could cosplay any male anime character, who would you play? Uh, Papua. Because he can be shirtless. That would be awesome. How liberating. Yes. <laughs> Oh, not a whole lot because of the mouth flaps, but every once in a while we get to like throw in a crazy line and that's awesome. Like if you guys have been watching, uh, sometimes it's not the line, it's just the, the read. Like on Dragon Ball Super, um, Bulma sees Yamcha and she's like, oh, this is my friend, Yamcha. <laughs> and then Chris threw in a line about, oh yeah, let's go see Yamcha. Yamcha. <laughs> yeah. What do you love most about your fiancé? Oh. <laughs> later and go, oh my god, I had no idea. Um, yes, but I still have to do that. I don't have one yet, so if you guys have ideas, let me know. <laughs> if Ian made you something for dinner and you could throw it on, what would it be? <laughs> Juice 
and rum and coconut, and sometimes they put a little honey around the side. Little with, on top. Yeah, little nutmeg. It's also my favorite drink, and Ian is my favorite Ian of all time. So. Aww. One of my good friends, so yes. Uh, what's the weirdest gift you've ever received? Uh, half eaten cookies? <laughs> <laughs> because there is somebody on her side, for whatever reason. Yes! <laughs> Actually, let's go here. Yes! Yes! Ina and your boyfriend have a kid. What do you bring to your husband's wake? <laughs> <laughs> cake! <laughs> Always cake! Yes! Urza versus Mira Jane. Oh, the creator of Fairy Tale already answered that. He said Mira Jane. Hey! Really? If you had to do a pickup line, your characters, what would it be? A pickup line? Uh, <laughs> Hello, baby. <laughs> How would you like to come and see my quirk? <laughs> my favorite color in the alphabet is purple because 42 is the meaning of life. Yes. <laughs> Obi-Wan Frosty Tips. That's what I think. <laughs> <laughs> if the tree, uh, romance couple over that, had a baby, describe the baby five months perfection. <laughs> <laughs> it would be a very pretty baby. Let's be real. It would be a very pretty, very talented, very business oriented. Actually, their baby would probably be gone. <laughs> 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 what type of tree would you build a house in? What type of tree would I build a house in? Um, actually, you know what? I'd probably go for the smallest little tr little ha little tree, so it'd be like a Charlie Brown tree, so my house would kind of sit on top of it. So, yeah. What's something that Ron doesn't know about? Oh. You're in trouble. I don't think you, I don't think there's anything that you don't. We talk all the time. Seriously, we communicate. I will just tell you guys this: if you are in a relationship, or you ever get in a relationship. Communicate, communicate, communicate. Talk about everything. Put it all on the table. If they do something that annoys you, you tell them then. Because don't hold it in and like let it fester and grow and annoy you. No, you tell them then. You, you cut that shit out. You cut that shit out right now. And they do. And then life is great. So communicate about everything. I really don't think there's anything you don't know about me. That's really kind of frightening. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. Is there a tea company? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. I don't know. Check Adagio. Tea? Adagio. Adagio.com. Adagio. 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 Yes. How much do you love crayons? I love crayons. Especially because you can melt them and make art. It's awesome. <laughs> I'm not good with them, but you know. Who? Yes. Um, sorry. Do you, uh, I forgot. I'm sorry. No, you're good. Oh, if you think of it, let me know. Do you wish you had more screen time when making Full Metal Fantasy with Vic Mignola? Oh, thank you. That was super fun, except that it was raining. <laughs> but it was super, super fun. I would have loved to have done that. Um, how much time do we have? What time is it? One minute. One minute. Oh, my gosh. Okay, yes. Um, so you know how in high school there's like the cool type and the like which type would you uh, say? Uh, I, I like cool type, I would say. Like if, I, like if we go fairy tale, like what are the guys... That appeal to me, not Mira Jane as a character. I like Gaiju. I like a bad boy with a piercing. Seven solid. Seven yes. five solid. Since your uh, husband or should be knows everything about you, what do you wish he didn't know about you? Oh gosh, there's, a, there's some stuff in that college time that I kind of wish he didn't know. But you know, when you communicate, they get to know all of that stuff. Oh sure, let me tell the whole room <laughs> the thing that I wish the man who loves me and forgives everything about me wouldn't know. But yeah. you guys can. Yeah. <laughs> so we'll just say college. Yeah. It was totally an accident. I was an actor, and somebody said audition, and I did, and woo! Yes. Uh, no, I don't actually. It's funny because I like really, really bright colors, but you can't always do that on top. So usually my underwear are really, really bright, and then the top is very unusual. What? 